Let's look at columns in Smartsheet. The key column in any sheet is the primary column, indicated in bold. The primary column should contain unique or key information about each row in your sheet. In this case, the key information we are tracking is requests, so we've named our primary column Request. Columns are automatically given text and number properties. You can change column properties at any time by double-clicking or right-clicking on the column label. Choose from Contact List, Date, Drop-down List, Checkbox, Symbols, Auto Number, or System Columns. Contact List columns make it easy to assign rows to contacts from your Smartsheet contact list. Columns with date properties enable you to view dates on a calendar. Use columns with start and end dates to view your work as a Gantt chart. Drop-down lists make data more consistent and easier to work with and give you the option to use card view to work with information in your sheet. Columns with checkboxes indicate when items are complete. Symbol columns show status, flag items as urgent, or indicate favorites. Auto number properties make it easy to track items by giving each request a unique ID that can include letters as well as numbers. System columns can be used to track created and modified dates, as well as who created or modified an entry. You can insert or delete columns, rename columns, and change the layout and order of columns in your sheet. You can also hide columns and lock columns you don't want other users to be able to change, and sort and filter columns to see different subsets of data. And that's columns in Smartsheet.